Okay, it's just me or time's just flying by so fast like just a week ago it felt like it's a new season and now we're in a brand new one. That means there's a new battle pass and of course the buffs and nerfs and there is the brand new SMG, the MX9 and the brand new NA45, the AMR. Uh, anyways, before the video starts, if you want me to make more tips and tricks or top 5 best guns, then can you please go check if you're subscribed already and if you haven't please hit the subscribe button and also please leave a like as that would simply make my day anyways enough of that and let's get straight into the video all right so for the number five spot we have the as val the as val has an ads time of 22 ms and a time to kill of 432 ms the AS Val is considered a meta weapon due to the fact that it has a fast time to kill and fast fire rate and of course fast ADS time but that depends on your build. Anyways the AS Val is pretty versatile as for me it's the best 4 tap AR. The AS Val is a 4 tap AR that can function like an SMG and as an SMG main myself I use the AS Val just like an SMG. The AS Val can be used for close, mid and even long range with no problem at all and it is easy to control the AR. So that gives us our number 5 spot the AS Val. Okay the AS Val was sick but we have a better gun. So at the number 4 spot we have the QQ9. With an ADS time of 19 milliseconds, the QQ9 is a fast agile SMG, it's a killing machine, and has the TTK of 358 milliseconds. The QQ9 is a favorite of mine, and I'm pretty sure you have used this gun as well, as it was meta back in Season 3. Where, when you join the lobby, you will at least encounter 2-3 to three players running around with the QQ9. The QQ9 has fast mobility, okay, high damage, and can be pretty versatile. The QQ9 is very easy to control as its only problem will be the screen shake. But other than that, it's pretty simple to control the gun. And that's gonna be it for our number 4 spot, the QQ9. Alright, QQ9 was great, but there is a better SMG out there with a faster time to kill. And that SMG will be in our number 3 spot, the Fennec. The Fennec has the same damage as the QQ9, but the only difference is it's a bit harder to control. And it has a faster time to kill, of course. With a TTK of 330 milliseconds, the Fennec can easily dominate in a close to semi mid-range gunfight. The Fennec is harder to control due to the fact that it shoots very fast just like how the MSMC is now. The Fennec has the fastest mobility among all SMGs and the Fennec has the fastest time to kill among all the meta weapons in this list. Due to its damage, it's just gonna be at the number 3 spot. Okay, we are now down to the top 2 meta weapons. But anyways, before we continue, all the stats I have here is all researched by me and tested by me. So if you disagree, this is based on what I have researched and yeah. But anyways, let's go back to the top 2 weapons in this list. So, for the number 2 spot, we have... Drumroll please! The Holger! Okay, I know you guys are gonna be like, what and why is the Holger not number 1? Well, let me explain. The Holger is an LMG that can be used just like an AR. It's like the M4 LMG but way better. Okay, the Holger will be the right gun for you if you want to get your first rank nuke. The Holger can be used in different locations just like close range, mid range, and even long range gunfights. The Holger is the best LMG I have used. Of course, there's still the chopper but there's just something which doesn't make it feel right anymore so with the time to kill of 442 ms the holger is a high capac capacity high damage and agile lmg although there is the downside of slow ads yet still the right attachments you can change that factor of it 
this gun can give you more confidence in using it in no matter what the situation is. Okay, as you can see from the gameplay, the number one, also known as the best weapon for this season, will be the MX-9. Okay, let me explain. The MX-9, okay, I understand you guys might be confused, but let me explain once again. The MX-9 has a certain attachment called the Large Caliber, where it's just like the OTM mag for the DRH, but, you know, just like the OTM mag, it gives you more damage. The MX-9 is pretty versatile, and it has high mobility. If you have seen my video using the MX-9, which is also the clip I'm using right now in the test server, you will notice how it's a 4-tap SMG with a TTK of 394 MS, it's really okay for an SMG. It has high mobility and it has almost the same stats as the Peacekeeper. But this gun is way easier to control. I promise you guys you will enjoy using this gun as soon as you get it. Like promise my guy. Anyways, uh, here's the build for my MX-9 or... All the gunsmith builds will also be in the discord server if I ever forget to add them into the video but yeah that's gonna be it for our number one spot also known as the best meta slash best weapon for this season the MX-9 hey hope you guys enjoyed the video if you do please make sure to smash the like button and also hit the subscribe button and the bell icon as well so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video anyways join my discord as well since that's where I'm gonna be posting most of my gunsmith builds and yeah that's gonna be it so let's roll the outro bye